particular version of Sweeney Todd is both immersive and interactive. This is very gritty and real and truthful, almost cinematic actually. As the show progresses, he begins the journey as this man who's escaped from prison after 15 years of imprisonment and comes back for revenge. And then he meets Mrs. Lovett who gives him this whole other idea about a booming business so that he can extract his revenge and her pie company can thrive. He really starts to enjoy this feeling of power and almost playing God. When you talk about live theater, it doesn't get more live than uh, Sweeney Todd at the Barrow Street Theater. Most people that know me and Norm know that he's my brother from another mother. When I had strep throat, Norm brought me chicken soup and antibiotics, he walked my dog. He's literally like a brother to me. When I left Phantom of the Opera, Norm uh, became the first African American phantom in New York City and it was like I passed, passed the torch to my brother. So I thought it was really fitting that Norm was leaving Sweeney and uh, I got to uh, take the torch back, so to speak, from Norm. He's one of my best friends. I am at uh, Barber on Pearl in Dumbo, Brooklyn. It's my neighborhood. Lots of cool coffee places, lots of, you know, family-run businesses. That's why I love this barber shop. They do the traditional razor like we use in the show. This was actually the first time I've ever gotten a shave with a straight razor here. And that was a whole different experience. There was no fear factor. It's not like me wielding the blade in the show. When I was 12 years old, my parents took me to see my first show because I really didn't have a lot of direction in my life. I didn't know what I wanted to do. And the minute that curtain went up, I connected to theater and it gave me an anchor. And I think it's so important for our young people to be exposed to theater, especially theater like Sweeney Todd that's innovative and immersive and not your normal uh, proscenium experience. It's really important to, to give our children the gift of, of theater.